Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we will talk about the most pirates fear, the Mark 3825 mm Bushmaster. Before watching the video, please like, comment, and subscribe my channel. Also known as the Bushmaster, this weapon is a navalized version of the chain gun, an externally powered weapon developed by Hughes for the U.S. Army as the Mark 242. The name chain gun derives from the use of a loop of roller chain to drive the bolt back and forth. A single electric motor located in the receiver group powers all moving parts for the ammunition feeding, loading, firing, extraction, and cartridge ejection operations. The weapon can be fired in both the single shot mode and in automatic mode. This gun had a long road to travel to gain acceptance onto USN ships. In 1977, the Chief of Naval Operations, CNO, approved their use to replace aging 20mm Mark 16 guns, which were difficult to maintain and did not use standard NATO ammunition. However, the gun was not operationally evaluated for naval use until the summer of 1987. Then, with the urgent need for such weapons in the Persian Gulf, Production of this weapon was greatly accelerated. Much of the necessary work was done at Naval Weapons Support Center Crane, which was responsible for the design of the Mark 88 mounting. The Mark 38 machine gun system, MGS, denotes the Mark 242 when mounted on the Mark 88 single mounting. The Mark 38 MGS was employed aboard various combatant and auxiliary ships in the Middle East Force Escort Operations and during Operations Desert Shield and Desert Storm. The weapons are maintained in a rotatable pool, available for temporary installation on various deploying ships and permanent installation on certain amphibious and auxiliary ships, patrol craft, and Coast Guard cutters. In the event of a major malfunction, the gun can be removed from the mount and another one installed in its place in five minutes by two people. As the Mark 88 is manually trained and lacks stabilization, target tracking is difficult when the MGS is used on a small combatant ship. For this reason, the Navy started a program to develop a low-cost, remotely controlled, and stabilized version designated as the Mark 38 Mod 2. Improvements compared to the Mark 38 include an on-mount electro-optical sight, improved ammunition loading, improved man-slash-machine interface, an embedded trainer, and ship roll compensation. The new system also provides the capability to have two different ammunition types loaded and selecting between them from the remote console. The remote operator console is a 12-inch, 30.5 centimeters, color LCD equipped with 12 soft keys. The picture on the computer screen is extremely clear, displaying a real-time, 360-degree, 7,000 to 8,000-yard picture. In 2003, successful testing was conducted aboard the USS Decatur, DDG-73, and USS Howard, DDG-83, USS Princeton, CG-59, was the first ship to have this weapon system permanently installed. Tests on Princeton demonstrated a very robust capability during day and night tracking and firing on a high-speed maneuvering surface target, HSMST. During the live fire against the HSMST, the system gained the kill of the target at more than twice the range of the current Mod 1 gun. Other tests have shown a two- to three-fold increase in probability of hit, POH, versus the Mod 1. In 2004, United Defense received a $395.5 million contract to produce the Mark 38 Mod 2 weapon system. The contract runs through 2010 with the first eight units and spares to be delivered in 2004, 13 in 2000, and 5 in 67 in 2006. The Mark 96 Mod 0 is a two-axis, stabilized mounting that contains both the 25 mm M242 chain gun and a 40mm Mark 19 grenade machine gun. The system combines elements from the Mark 3 Mod 9 and Mark 38 gun mounts to provide a lightweight, low-cost solution to small-caliber gun requirements, including a man-in-the-loop system for low-intensity combat situations. The operator sits on the mount, which moves to compensate for the pitch and roll of the ship. 
Rheinmetall Edge has also adapted the M242 for a naval mounting designated as MLG-25. The USN purchased a total of 243 guns between fiscal year 1,986 and fiscal year 1,992. The Mark 38 Mod 3 is a new development program, which has an updated multifunction display, MFD, and a new control console. Besides the 25mm Butchmaster, an option for mounting a coaxial 7.62mm chain gun is available. So that is it guys for my today's video. I hope you enjoy. Thank you very much for watching.